What it do, what it do, YouTube? It's your boy, Young Shawty, and we are back with more God of War. Now, last episode, Atreus snuck off uh, to find Freya, to find, try to talk to Freya, but Freya was not having it, and now we're back to Kratos, I guess. Kind of don't remember. Um, but yeah, let's get to it. for coming with us I am whenever you're ready well whenever your father's ready I should say if my counsel might help you towards the answers you seek it's the least I can do to repay you plus I think it will do me well to see the light of elf time again mm. that elf light is some good shit mm. Oh, where'd this plan come from? Oh, from Mimir, of course. I was merely asking how you found me, and he explained the secret prophecies inside the Yodnar shrines. Fascinating. From there, we said to taking stock of which shrines we'd seen, at which point your father recalled finding drawers outside the Temple of Light. And now that we can actually go to Alfheim, the prudent course of action became self-evident. Nary a lost step for the world's smartest man. Even without feet, he will forgive the levity. I was always fond of her talks, you know? Aye. And it's good to see you a free man again, old friend. A companion accessory slot is empty. Select your companion in the armor menu. Oh yeah. Okay, okay, okay. He's not the landlord. Just checking this out for a minute. At your service. That belonged to one of the rebels, didn't it? Poor souls, fighting the Aesir is a thankless job, as you well know. He really did it. Tyr really slept in my broom closet. Is that normal for you tall, godly sorts? Or just the ones locked up for a lifetime or two? Well, he didn't even answer. <laughs>
might be my best piece yet today. We got that out the way. Right behind you. I'll meet you at the gateway presently, friends. Excuse me, sir. Mind if I take a little peek at you? I promise I'll be brief. My goodness, what a strapping physique. Capable of an astounding variety of acts of violence, I imagine. What is happening? <laughs> this must be the squirrel that tames the wall tree. That delectable aroma. Could it be? Pardon the intrusion. Ah, yes. Amber resin. Delightfully nutty with a hint of squiddy. No, no. Not one for gastronomic exploration, I see. Wait, if you're Radit Hosker, why are you so different when we summon you for help? It's a long story. <laughs> but you are correct. I am indeed Radit Hosker. Radit Hosker. is merely one of my spectral aspects. And a particularly nasty one at that. I consider him so far removed from myself that he's practically a different person. Speaking mm. of... Bitter, would you like to come out and see your friends? Fuck off, I'm busy! <laughs> I suppose that was to be expected. Anyway, now that I've polished up all this regimen for you, would you like the seed back? It is the seed. Indeed. A seed of Yggdrasil, to be precise. Since my dwarven tenants performed their little reconfiguration, You'll need seeds like these to open up new destinations on my tree. Mm. <laughs> yes, my tree. Here, let me show you. So that's why good Master Brock needed an alpine seed. Clearly, you have important matters afoot. That seed you found unlocks Niflheim of all places, a realm as ancient as it is vaguely sticky. Svartalfheim remains at your disposal if you have unresolved business amongst the dwarves. Hmm. Yeah, I could do the favors later. I could do the favors later. Perhaps as we travel, you can tell me the tale of your prior visit to the land of the elves. Sure, I can. Alfheim was the first time we ever roamed around with using your temple. Or you tried coming. Odin cast a spell on her. She can't leave Midgard. That's terrible. So then we fought our way through an army of dark elves to get to the light. You interfered in the elf war. Not by choice. We sought to fill our Bifrost, and they attacked us. And the dark elves were covering it with their sticky hive stuff. When we freed it, light elves came back. They seemed better in Alfheim. <laughs> Did they now? Roa's secret. Alfheim. It's been so long. Not sure where the temple is from here, but that's where we'll find Groa's shrine. Broken history. Aye. Not exactly an easy fix for that. I see.
see the elves continue their war. Yeah. So much for things being better in Alpha. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Thimble Winter hit Alfheim hard. No. Storms have plagued Alfheim's deserts long before Thimble Winter. A living desert. Huh. It was once full of life, you know. And music. The song of the sand. Called it. Gone now. Another victim. Hmm. I kinda wish I had a camera so y'all would get some of these. Hold on. I hear something out there. Something big. It's in pain. Our goal is at the temple. Not in the desert. There. The temple of light. Grow's shrine is at the top. Freyr never bothered returning to Alfheim, did he, Mimir? I no. I assumed the fate of his own realm took precedence. Wait, Freyr's brother? Yes. Cut from a different cloth, that one. Oh, I thought I hit him. Got him. There's a barricade up ahead. What are those shiny rocks? Twilight stone. A rare material that can take millennia to form. Majestic, isn't it? Occasionally, the light of Alfheim will bind to a rock and crystallize, growing like moss on a fallen tree. Truly a wonder of the nine realm. Oh! I didn't know it could do that. Oh my god. Move. Bang bangs. Freya's brother. How was he involved? Long ago, Freya of the Vanny traveled to Alpha, where he discovered a once beautiful land devastated by war. Using his divine powers, he set about cultivating a tenuous peace among the elves. Did you mention how that peace fell apart as soon as he left? I was getting to it. You hear that? Oh, no. That's enough. Please. You don't need to do this. We don't want to hurt you. Man. What is that? Oh my Why are you fighting us? We helped you last time. Atreus, focus. I hate Alpha. Hey, your bum. Come here. Weave. Oh my gosh! Mm. 
Dang, Tia. So your father said. I'm just naive, I suppose. No, just an optimist, old friend. Best we move on for now, brother. Don't think we have the right tools for this one. Okay, cool. Guess not. It's so tall. We came in from the top last time. Didn't realize all this was even down here. It's an older gate, built to promote cooperation between the elves, but it looks like it's been sealed for some time. I'll go first. Atreus, let me know when I've reached halfway. So, uh, what's happening right now? This seal is meant to represent the balance of the realm when Freya was here. Light and dark, working together in harmony. How's that look, Atreus? Good, I think. Father, now you go. Unfortunately for Alfheim, Freya couldn't accept his sister's decision to marry Odin. He returned to Vanaheim, and left this realm to its fate. To be fair, the Aesir did set him on fire that one time. Hmm. The door should have opened. Are you sure it's balanced? Yeah, but the realm isn't. Not anymore. Father, try pulling it the other way. Yeah, yeah! And here, you keep pushing forward. <laughs> Fine work, Atreus. Shall we? What's a dark yellow statue? Temple of Light. That's just how they looked before the division. The division? Yes. The elves weren't always split between light and dark, you know. This statue depicts the elves before the war. Before they discovered the power of it. Oh. Oh, light. Guess some things don't change. Lock the door. There's a light crystal. Yes. The stone briefly imparts a bit of light to your axe. That's useful. What's that sound? No sense in spoiling the surprise. Oh, it's the light. Ah! Ow. I've never seen the Lake of Souls so volatile. Aye. Temple winter, you reckon? Of course. Making the light unstable. So the base of this light well, that's the Lake of Souls. Hmm. Yeah. Sorry for not talking. When the elves discovered its potential, they built this temple to harness that energy. A smashing success, to say the least. Many of them became addicted to the newfound power, and thus the light elves were born. Sorry for not talking as much. I'm trying to focus. We oh. You don't have much of a choice here. Speaking of light elves, let me try to time for them time for some blade. Time for some blade work. Oh. Dang. Hmm. Dang. Oh 
my gosh. I am rusty. I am a rust bucket, bro. Speaking of light elves, let me try talking to them again. They may just to let these two do their thing, brother. Light bombs. Oh my Sit him down Oh my That jumping punch is crazy on light bridges now the bridges are gone i have an idea to get us across <laughs> lucky for us swearing off violence doesn't mean he can't disfigure some architecture this way shrine away <laughs> I like that tier is, I mean, he's a bit of an optimist now. He's not like a fighter fighter, but kind of like tier, though. Oh, those were just the foot soldiers. They'll get more dangerous the further up we go. Great. So if these elves use the light to build doors and make themselves stronger, what do the Dark Elves want with it? To return it back to its source. To them, the natural resources of Alfheim are sacred, none more so than the light itself. Aye, the light elves' success came at a terrible price. Alfheim's once lively desert withered into a storm-ridden wasteland soon after the creation of this temple. There's more Twilight Stone up there. Oh, I'm trying to get a better angle. Oh. Gotta be a better angle on that fire. Light elves ahead. I'll handle this. Uh, maybe that's not a great idea. Oh, there, friends. Salutations. We mean you no harm. Tear. Get back. If you can't fight, don't fight. Ali. Bye bye, sir. Mm. Oh, 
Come on. Give me that health. He did something. He did help us out with that pushing. Bruh. Set him down. Oh my. Mm. This man is brutal. Hey, you did help us out with that push, though. Dark elves want the souls and the light left alone. The light elves want to keep using them. That's the long and short of it. Aye. So then, which side is right? Really is it so simple? I'm not our place to say. This is an elven conflict. I said as much the last time we were in Alfheim. Right. They sure made a lot of these light doors. Mm. Fortifications. Aye. None too eager to let the Dark Elves run the roost again. Looks right. Excellent. Let's continue our set, yes. Again? Incoming, above you. 
Move. It's down. Bro, I hate these things. Jesus. More inspiring lyricism from the mind of Kvasia. Crap seer. I still gotta leave you to it. Yeah, you bum. I think this is a tougher one. Molly walk. Mm -mm, boy, come here. Sit him down. Facts. I don't play fair. You hear me? I'll meet you on the other side. This mystic doesn't see us. Oh, that was lit. Sit him down. Oh. We can continue up this way. Where are you? Father, over here. Um, okay. Here they come. Do what you must. Alright. They need to relax, man. I am so trash at this game. <laughs> The blinding stuff, bro. Hey, you bum. What is hell? Sit him down. Shall we continue? 
Better not let him hear you say that. Well, at least we're getting closer. Look up. See? Feels even taller on the inside. Can't believe all this was down here. Come here, boy. Come here, boy. Come here. Bye bye, sir. I am so big. No, that's not what I wanted. Oh, you need to... Start using the blaze for real. Oh my god! You can relax, bum. Are you hiding, boy? Nope. 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 